How would you respond if I told you that you are not your thoughts? Meaning that whatever it is you are thinking, that is actually not you. It is a part of you, but it's not you. How come? Because when you start observing your thoughts, you soon realize they are just mental events that come and go. And those negative ones are simply symptoms of stress because you are experiencing some sort of discomfort internally or externally, thoughts arise to try and make sense of the situation or to try and keep you away from danger, to protect you and save you. So when negative thoughts come about, understand these are only symptoms of stress. They are mental events that come and go. And when you observe them from a little bit more distance, you understand that when something can be perceived, it is not you, right? This plant, if I can perceive this plant in the back, <laughs> I understand it is not me. The same way you are not your thoughts. If they can be perceived, that means they are not you. So start walking around this planet, observing your thoughts from a little bit more distance and then choosing how you want to respond to them. Don't let them control your life. Don't let them take you down these unproductive paths. Accept them, acknowledge them, notice them, and then just the way they came, let them pass. You are not your thoughts. You are you. <laughs> thoughts are mental events that come and go. They are real, but they're not necessarily true. So observe, observe, observe. Put them into clouds above your head and you will see life gets a little easier.